the gates of mighty kingdoms lies a vast, unexplored world. A world of honor. Once you get into it, you can't leave it. You can't leave it. The world of Warcraft. It's begun. Young heroes, I was once like you. You have come to this place seeking to bring judgment upon the damned. You will venture deep into forgotten lands. see wonders beyond imagining. But be warned. The land itself will rise up against you. Long forgotten terrors will smother your courage. You will sacrifice everything as the final darkness falls. Steps all along. So come then, you heroes. Come in all your power and glory. For in the final hour, all must serve the one true king. My son, the day you were born, the very forests of Lordaeron whispered the name Arthas.
child. I watched with pride as you grew into a weapon of righteousness. Remember, our line has always ruled with wisdom and strength. And I know you will show restraint when exercising your great power.
teenager hooked on violent computer games. He's playing them an incredible 16 hours a day. His mother says his personality has changed and that he's become moody and violent and his addiction is tearing the family apart. They don't realise how addictive it can be. It's a world of fantasy and fun. But for 16-year-old Cameron Sandler, this is more than a game. It's an addiction and an illness. I am addicted to the game, but I'm not fully addicted. Like, I can quit whenever I want. This really kicks ass, doesn't it? It all started 18 months ago when Cameron discovered World of Warcraft. Oh, now I'm going to kill you all. This never-ending computer game is played by millions around the globe. From America, Germany, China, all of Europe, England. And you've got friends in all of these places? Yeah. And that's what you refer to them as, your friends? Yeah. They play simultaneously for hours on end. Well, when you're ready. Fighting and killing their enemies. I don't, I don't know why, I just eventually got addicted to it. Cameron has up to 500 players on his team, known as a guild. Uh, the longest I've ever played it for was 12 hours, and that was, um... Uh, that was um, just because the guild wanted me on for that long. Oh, you took my kill. Why do you talk with an American accent when you're talking to these people? I don't know. It's probably like you move to a new country or something. You just end up picking it up. And that's not all he picked up. Cameron is often up at four in the morning to begin playing. Sometimes he goes right through the night. His mum estimates that on average, he's in front of that screen 16 hours a day. My choice to play it, um, my choice to be addicted to it. Cameron reckons he can stand up and walk away whenever he wants, but try telling that to his mum. Denise believes he's hooked. And just like an alcoholic, a smoker or a drug addict, Getting off, beating the habit, is going to be an enormous challenge. Regardless of who's right and wrong in this household, experts are now warning that addiction to technology is becoming the fastest growing illness of the 21st century. No, his situation isn't rare at all. In fact, he's just the tip of probably a very undisclosed iceberg. Psychologist Edwina Cowdery and her colleagues are seeing diagnostic. more and more cases every day. The DSM-4, which is the Diagnostic Statistical Manual, basically it's the psychologist's bible of all the things that we're meant to know about, it doesn't have internet addiction in it. I would suspect the next one does because of the amount of internet addiction in various forms for various ages that we're starting to see. Do you regret? discovering this game? Mm, kind of taken a lot of time away from me. Um, I could have made up, you know, going out, exploring some more, meeting new people, but other than that, no, because I've gone and explored inside the game. I've met new people inside the game. Warcraft has had such an impact on players, there are chat rooms on the internet dedicated to addicts. An assistant professor from Harvard University claims up to 40% of users are hooked. Rise up, Argent Crusaders! The hour of justice has come! Dark 
ancient powers you have slain. soul was one of the first to be devoured by your evil. There are thousands more bound within this blade, and they cry out for release. Look now to your defenses, my son, for the champions of justice gather at your gates.